Hello guys, welcome to Reprotect tutorial and in this tutorial chapter we are going to see selector, property and their values. While we are writing a CSS, selector, properties and values play an important role. Now, here is an example that we have earlier seen in previous video where we have applied border and background color property to the paragraph element. So, in this case, the paragraph element is our selector. The selector is a way to group together all the properties using the curly braces and this will also help us to apply these property to the specific elements of the HTML document and there are different type of selectors such as class, id, tag, universal, group. We will be saying that in future video. The syntax for the selector is very simple. First, we have to specify the selector. So, in this case, we have specified P for paragraph element and then specify the opening and closing bracket. And in between these brackets, we have different set of properties grouped together. After the selectors, we have the properties and their respective values. So, the syntax for applying the properties and their values is property name colon property value. So, this will help us to specify what will be changed for the given HTML element. It can be color, font, folder, background, position. There are a number of properties that we will be seeing in our future videos. But in this example, order is our property and property value is 10 px solid red. And in case of background color, so background color is the property and the yellow is the value. So there are different set of properties and their respective values. We'll be seeing them in further videos in detail. I hope you have understood the selectors, properties and values. If you have liked the video, please subscribe and please share a comment so that I can improve the quality of the videos.